I've lived in this house for 11 years now and the kitchen was something that was always on my list of things to do. It was absolute disaster zone. My friend and I actually ended up painting that ugly puke yellow that you see. <laughs> it was actually in, it was, uh, what we did is we sponged it. The point was I had my sister, my niece, my brother-in-law living here with me at one point. They were here for two years. The house just got cluttered. I had like an Amazon theme going on here with a rainforest in the back. When I would entertain, my neighbors would come over. They were like, uh, Dave, you need to update your walls, you know, at least. I wanted to get the thing completely gutted. Start off with a clean slate, including the walls. Initially, I wanted to go with all white. Since I was doing all this from scratch and since I knew that I didn't want to go through a renovation again for a very, very long time, I decided to basically put in what I wanted, which is radiant flooring. It's really good, especially in the winter. I'm right above a garage, so it does get cold. And being that it's tile, the radiant heat actually is really nice. I actually install all the cabinets myself. Kudos to IKEA because they make some really good stuff. But when I was putting it together, it was super easy. I love that picture there. What Reiko and her team did is they came in, they pulled in some of the reds and pulled into that amazing crock pot. In order to liven up the kitchen a little bit, they decided to pull out a few things that I had and it makes it look a lot better. The KitchenAid mixer was gifted to me and I didn't think I'd ever use it, but I guess it's time for me to start baking. As soon as I got the kitchen done, I, I've been entertaining a lot more, having gatherings. The guys are like, what are you doing this for, you know? But I don't know, it's something I wanted to do for a long time. It's great, I love it. 